Bitch, are you kidding me? I did not ask for this shit. No? <laughs> Look, I'm like really happy that like you'd want a snow soul, but uh... I don't need that right now. I've got a lot of things I need. Not a lot. Oh my god, I need to calm down. I've got a few things I need to do today. I'm gonna go to Troy Arake to go get my my skint. Get my skint done. Um, I haven't been there in a long time. Um, Joan goes there all the fucking time. But some of us don't have the luxury of being able to go. I'm looking pale. Troy Arake. If you don't know already, I've talked about it a million times. I talk about their skincare all the time. They're like this spa. Ooh. But I'm gonna like cover this one. Hey, hey, but then, eh, pfft, then they are a skincare spa that provide the Troy pill treatment. It's kind of like an alternative to like lasers. Obviously, it's not as strong as lasers, but um, you would need them more often if you want like the effects of them. My skin's been getting much better recently. My, what do we do? Touch this skin. Touch all of this. My skin's getting better much more recently, but it's been a while since I've gotten Troy and that always makes my skin look so much more, um, what am I trying to say? It looks so much better. So, uh, I'm gonna go there and hopefully I can pick up more Troyotica skincare because, girl, I've been like testing other skincare, well, specifically cleanser, and like nothing is like making me happy. Like, it's also subpar to me. Because, like, when you touch luxury, you can't go back. Chanel. <laughs> okay, I'm, like, trying too fucking hard now. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. When it comes to skincare, I don't think you... Uh, okay, because... What I'm trying to say. I think I'm still going to try to test skincare for you guys. Because I think it's important to include it, you know, as part of this channel. You know what I mean? Not everyone is interested in just makeup. And I still get a lot of um, comments about... Like, oh my god, the comments that I get about like, um, what do you think of this product? And I'm like, I haven't even tried it. They're like, uh, what do you think of this versus this? And I'm like, I've never even heard of that in my life. So, you know, I still need to test skincare, but I think I will always keep Troyotica skincare on hand. Oh no, of course, if until I find something better. So that, you know, I have something to fall back on. Because right now I don't have anything to fall back on. Because right now all I have is just like, skincare that I'm testing, if that makes sense. Anyway... I need to go to Toyota and then after that I need to go send some packages. <laughs> Christmas presents like sending them right after Christmas. I got so busy that I even you know when you're in school and you're like anticipating Christmas and like the week the even like the beginning of December, like, oh my god, it's the month of Christmas, like I'm so excited. I can't wait. Oh my god, it's gonna feel like forever. And like it feels like for up until December twenty-fifth. For me, I was so busy, like yeah, I've been so busy that it was fucking December 24th. I'm like, oh shit, tomorrow is Christmas. Today it's obviously not Christmas. That, that was that was a few days ago. But yeah, like when you're big, when you keep yourself busy, a lot, like everything seems to just pass by. Oh my god, fuck. Oh sh mm. I pulled it right out of the rut. I pulled it out of the rut. I need to go wash my face and then I will go get dressed so she can go, uh, so she can go out. Look, I know I'm about to be getting my face washed anyway. But I am not leaving the house without this brow on. Mm -mm, no. Okay, never mind. I put a little bit of makeup on. I <laughs> see the Troy Attica A Plus cushion. Um, I, this one I don't feel bad about. If I'm on a day where, like, I don't want to wear makeup, but uh, I really need to wear makeup, uh, which would be like every day, I'll wear this one because it's just skincare and a cushion. So I don't feel bad. And this is good for. I, this is actually I forgot. I'm so okay, I have a review on this on my channel where I talk about it in full, but I forget, completely forget to mention the fact that it's meant for acne prone skin because it's from their, it's from Troy Attica's acne sensitive skincare line and that's like the makeup for that line. But yeah, I'll use that cushion on nights where I'm like, where I like want to go out, you know what I mean? I'm going to be out all night, <laughs> but I don't want makeup on my skin all night. I'll put that on because it's mostly skincare, so. <laughs> Look, it's the shoes that we bought together in my Christmas vlog. As usual, same clothes that I wear all the- oh, oh my god. Please stop being so rude, please. Same shit I've been wearing for the past however many days because it's too damn cold. I always wear this. I even have like heat tech, well heat tech, like you know the, the thing you wear underneath to keep yourself warm and I also have long johns under this. But, and yet, people still ask me like, aren't you cold Edward, aren't you cold? I'm fine, it's okay, don't worry. And it's like day 35 on the island, no, no, not really. I still have this. Thing. It's still there. I need to remember to put 
my lip balm on because I keep forgetting to do that. I was gonna bring a bag and everything, but I like, changed my mind. Two devil is at rank. So I ended up putting everything in my pockets. Look, it's Jesus Christ coming to save me from my homosexuality. Just kidding. I mean, it's like a really pretty day. I'm just really worried that it's gonna be like fucking freezing, which obviously it is. I mean, if it's gonna be snowing, it has to be freezing for it to do that. Bitch, if I slip on this fucking ice, I'm gonna fucking slap someone. Cause one time, I was coming, when I was living with my parents in Dongducheon, I came out of the fucking apartment and I saw the ice on the floor too. I was, I saw the ice. And I'll be, I was like, oh my God, wouldn't it be funny if like, I slipped and fell, I slipped and fell, bitch. I looked over, I was like, okay, you know what? Maybe no one saw it, no one saw it. I looked over in the fucking Ajashi, the guard of the apartment complex was like, I got my morning coffee. Me to, I'm like, my body's like relying on it now. It's gotten to that point. As a young kid, I was always like, why do, like, have I talked about this already? I think I already talked about this, about how adults were always like drinking coffee and I'm just like, why? But now my body's relying on it and I was experiencing literal, like literally experiencing like withdrawal symptoms then for like last week because I wasn't drinking coffee. So I had to buy myself some coffee today because I know if I don't drink it now, I'm gonna, my body's just gonna like shut down. The guy that works at that convenience store because I get coffee every morning, he like knows me now. He's like, oh God, it's this bastard again. God fucking damn it, I knew it. I knew I forgot something. I left my phone at home. I need that. I would come too damn early. I was like, leaving the house. Like, oh my god, I'm gonna be late. Nope, I forgot to 10 30, not 10. I'm just gonna go to the cafe and then to get some more coffee because can't get enough of it. Oh my god, Jesus, my nose, I look like fucking Rudolph. I just got donuts at Paris Baguette because there was no cafes here apparently, so I just got cafe latte. And I'm here at the office now. Hello, Irene. But she's always like, oh my god, I'm gonna try, but she knows she looks fucking cute. I came in to get my skin done, as I said earlier. I'm gonna eat this real quick, and then we're gonna go get ready to get, get her done. I'm doing the toy peel today, or why can I don't know. Have to see. But I have to see and grow my skin is shit. <laughs> my skin is already shit, whatever. <laughs> so this is, a, you guys have seen this room before. This is actually the training room, but this is also where uh, me and Joan get our treatments done. I get mine done here, but I know Joan goes to the Yong, is it the Yong Nung Po Spa? The Yong Nung Po Spa, what's the name of it? This one? The, the Yong Nung Po Spa. And Olive. And Olive. And Olive. And Olive? I just said an anal. I was like, what? Oh my god, it took like five years just to get into my little cocoon here. Yeah, I put the A plus cushion. Apparently I have a lot of white heads, like right here. This area here, and right here is where I tend to get a lot of like, white heads. Um, so I guess she's gonna like, extract them. <laughs> Thanks. Apparently my makeup is a lot thinner today. Not thinner, but I'm wearing less makeup today, so it looks better. <laughs> but I need to get into full glam like every day. So oh my god, I'm gonna like fall asleep already. If you're sleepy you can. Last time they said it's okay to sleep. I fell asleep and I snored like one time. <laughs> and that woke me up. It woke like everyone up and he started laughing at me. <laughs> so shy. Uh, say hello to Andy, the new. What's your new position? No, you got because you got promoted, I'm right? Executive. Oh, she's the executive. She's special. <laughs> yeah. Okay, girl. I'm special. <laughs> we need to, we need, <laughs> Andy, we need to work <laughs> on that. Friend. We're gonna, oh my god. We're gonna work on that. Uh, he needs to have very good treatment today. What is it called? Susu Hang. Balancing the body because apparently I'm unbalanced. Right, it is actually. What does that involve? Well, it involves some pain. Oh my god. <laughs> and actually, it will balance because your eyes is really red now. Mewa is going to check your susung hagang, and which means that your body is going to be everything like perfect as it has. <laughs> As if it can't get perfect enough. Yeah. <laughs> what? Apparently this is more painful than the Troy Peel. <sighs> oh lord. The thing is, Troy Attica is actually like a spa. 
sort of brand, I guess. So, um, <laughs> with this, I guess, sort of massage thing, she's also gonna do the aroma therapy kind of. Oh my lord, this. <laughs> oh god, we haven't even really started the. Oh sh. Can you take a second to appreciate how good Mela's skin is? Every day. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh lord. Uh, so apparently, because this side, which is massaging it, was really painful. So apparently this side is more, like, unbalanced, I guess? So, oh, oh please. Look at this. Look at this. Ow! Oh my god, ow! Really Jesus Christ! It doesn't even feel like he's- Oh my god! Actually, I'm pressing really lightly. <laughs> no, one more time, please. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god! <laughs> Andy. Why? Fix you in a good way. He says he has to fix me because I'm broken, apparently. After that, I think my soul is broken. Oh my god, now she is. Oh my god. What? Uh- She's taking out the whiteheads, I guess. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Holy crap, this is painful. I guess she's like pricking it open and then pushing it. Oh my. It hurts. It's really big. Oh my Can god. Oh. That was in my face. It's <gasps> they kept saying, oh, we're finished. Oh, good that, that. But then she keeps touching my face and she keeps looking for more. <laughs> They're all liars. They're fucking liars. I'm telling you. That was a medical grade alcohol that she rubbed on my face to disinfect, I guess. They always tell me to hold my breath, but it smells really good. I like the smell. Here we are. She's, here's the toy peel now. Okay, so what did... This one I've had several times, so I guess I'm used to it, but mm. earlier off camera, Andy was like, Mela, please do it as hard as you can and as painful as you can. Right. But uh, Andy, while you're here, could you explain to the camera? For those of you that don't know, I've made several videos about this, but for those of you that don't know, can you explain what Troy Peel is? Well, ladies and gentlemen. Oh God, here we go. <laughs> Please just tell us. Well, Troy Peel is like a peeling pro program that we sell to the beauty spa. Mm -hmm. And as we can see, the normal, very famous 300K, mm. the fan leading oh, Edward Avila Lord. is waiting for the treatment. We are putting the actually uh, micro needles from the plants. Mm -hmm. It has been extracted from the plants. So it's natural. It's natural, 100% mm -hmm. actually. Mm -hmm. Nothing chemical, no acid. Just like your skincare, right? It is like a skincare. Mm -hmm. We are just putting about five needles into one pores. So wow. what, what it does is that it is going to, you see as, you see nothing is there on the hair lines. Mm -hmm. So oh. everything is actually going into the, right. the pores. See that, she's pushing it into the skin so it yes, actually disappears. Right. Exactly. Yeah. And you can't see it, but I can actually feel it. It feels like needles. When I touch. Yeah, yeah. when yeah, you touch yeah. it. When you touch it. So if you like that person, you can touch it like that. Mm. And then the person can feel the needles. Mm -hmm. So this needle helps you to regenerate the skin. Mm -hmm. So for the ones who has some skin concerns about uh, scars or mm -hmm. acne mm -hmm. or wrinkles mm -hmm. or pigmentation of any sort, mm -hmm. we can actually help you to solve and improve the skincare. Right. And last time when we saw Edward for... <laughs> last time when we saw Edward for... A year ago. Mm -hmm. A I, year? Oh yeah, October. Yeah, October. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been over so, a year now. So, he used to have <coughs> some uh, skin... Um, skin scars, mm -hmm. he was worried about that and we did a few treatment and you could see some improvement yeah. in the specific mm -hmm. areas. Yeah. And also, after the treatment, you'll see less mm -hmm. redness on his face yeah. after the treatment. Is oh the lord, now it hurts. Oh god. It's not as bad as the first time I got it because I, I feel like as you get it more, you get used to it. You're right. Yeah, so... But I kind of attribute the feeling to... If you've ever shaved your legs and then you like 
try to shave again like maybe two days later when the hair's still kind of hard. Yes. It's, it's almost like that feeling. Some people say it is like scrubbing. Some yep. people say it is like a um, little bit painful. Mm -hmm. Some people say it's okay. But it's definitely not as painful as like a laser. I've gotten lasers before like fractal Oh, lasers, lasers is... <laughs> it's so much more painful. It is very painful. And the part what Mehua, the therapist is doing now to mm -hmm. your skin is I that we are trying that. to lift up the eyebrows mm -hmm. because at the end when we get old and saggy our eye <laughs> because i'm get... old and saggy yes no no he no, said yes this. he uh, said yes <laughs> we can see the lifting effect so it's all natural so you don't have to worry about the side effects or anything mm -hmm. like that uh, i'm sure we get a lot of questions but how much are these can this treatment range from from 150 USD mm -hmm. for one treatment to 350. Price depends on the spa, uh -huh. but in, in general, about 200 USD is a normal pricing. Okay. So if we put more solution and the concentration into the powder, mm -hmm. and then the price is a little bit expensive, mm -hmm. where if you don't have so much skin trouble, or if you could get just a mild treatment, it will be a little bit cheaper. Okay. But for Edward, because he's our VIP, so we try to put more powder. AK, they want me to hurt more. Yes. Yes, he said yes again. <laughs> oh, and also, the, where can I, where can you get it done? I know there's one in Myeongdong, outside exit six? Nine? Nine. Exit nine, right? Exit nine. There's a Choi Spa, and then at Yongdungpo Times Square. Right. Did she say it's near E-Mart? E-Mart. Yes, yes, yes. Near E-Mart. They and then if you type Troy Pill in Neighbor, which mm -hmm. is a Korean Google, mm -hmm. you can see tons of spa which sells the Troy treatments. Ah, so I it's look not quite just... handsome there. I like this camera. Lifting. <laughs> oh my god, I look terrible. <laughs> like a marine. A marine? <laughs> what? Sorry, it's sir! <laughs> I brought my marine uniform so you can wear it. Ah, yes. That's hot. For Edward and John to prepare the event. Mm. Oh, Lord. Okay, it's over. You go healing cream, right? Yeah, healing cream. Yeah, so she's just applying the healing. Do you want to healing cushion? Do you want to healing cushion? Do you want to A-plus cushion? Yes, I want to use that. Okay. It's a Celemix serum. Celemix serum? Ah, okay. So after you do the treatment, um, you're only supposed to use um, for the next three days, three, four mm -hmm. days. Um, we can only use. I use. What am I trying to say? I can oh. only use the Celamix serum and the cushion on my skin until all the peeling is gone, like, until the needles are dissolved in a, inside the pores. Um, oh my! So my skin looks fine now, but it feels. <laughs> Like shit, it feels terrible. It feels like there's needles inside. Ah, that's part of the process. One thing I like about this compared to lasers, though, is that my skin doesn't look like it, it'll peel. It's gonna peel, but it's not like red and disgusting like lasers for the next like week. It just feels like this and looks like this for about three days. My brows are gone. My face is tomato. Okay, I'm going to bed. Uh. Anyway, um, I thought I would take this time to announce that it's gonna be a meet and greet uh, with me and Joan. Sponsored by Toadike. The details will be down below. <laughs> We're not sure exactly, but there will be a meet and greet. So um, it'll be in Dongdaemun. Dongdaemun. Okay. So yeah, if you're interested in coming, you can go check that out. Tell your friends. Tell your family. Come join so we can all have a good time. Okay. <laughs> we are having Ojigo now. You like candy? My favorite. Okay, I'm leaving the office now. I changed my mind. I don't really want to go to the army base today. So I'm just gonna go over to the electronics market so I can go buy a new lens or look at some lenses that I can buy for my new camera because the lens I'm using now is not the right one. And because if you turn on my camera, there's like a circle. Basically, it's a full. My my camera requires a full frame lens, and the lens I have right now is not a full frame lens. So I see like a 
the circle around the things. So I have to zoom in so you don't see that round circle. But then that means I'm not using the camera's full potential because the quality is lowered when it zooms in. Because it's a digital. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go look at lenses. Just kidding. Hi, I'm back home. Bitch was too damn lazy to go. I figured I would just come home and rest because, bitch, I've been like too damn extra these days. I need to like calm down. I need to like take a rest. Also, I figure I would give me the time to um, you know, just stay home and like work on videos. Oh my god! Oh fuck! Oh, shoes. They gave this to me. This shit is so warm, but also can get really fucking hot. I remember I ordered them in bulk online, and I got the ones that come in a pack of two. Two like really small thin ones, and they're actually meant for in your shoes because one side of them will be adhesive, so you can stick it in your shoe. But like, that shit gets so hot, like. Burning hot. How, why are you gonna keep that? If your feet are on fire, like how are you gonna, you're gonna have to just rip your shoe off. You know what really pisses me off about companies that try to email me asking me to promote their products? Bitch, am I a miss? If you're gonna fucking contact me, at least get my gender right. Oh my god, these people. At least fucking change, like, your little template email. So that you get my name and title correct. Oh my god, even worse is when, I'm sure if you're a creator yourself, you you might get these emails where it's like, their template email at the beginning, it's like, insert name here. These fucking Chinese companies, I swear to god, they need to, they need to get their shit together. <clears throat> and also, oh, oh shit, god, oh my god. I put up that Q&A that I, yeah, I put up that Q&A and at some point there was that part where it was like, at talking about my hair color and then I put that picture of Pony when she had like really colorful hair and like literally as I was editing that I was like oh my god I want that hair color so I went on uh G Market and I ordered Manic Panic hair dye so I'm gonna be changing my hair color again to like that magenta fuchsia ma no magenta to like purple oh my god I love it oh god I'm editing my video with Yongguk and like it's fun but I spend so much time because this usually I slap together my videos to be honest um, Pretend like I'm making it all professional shit, but um, I do it in a way so that my workflow is faster But with videos like this, I'm putting all these little cute shits and like it's just a really long video too Because the footage is like an hour long so um, I have to sit there so, Oh my god, I almost said rimming kind of taking a look through the the footage um, You know and adding little Things to make it funny or whatever because for me if I felt like that day when I was filming I wasn't really that funny. I'll try to Make it funny through the editing If not, then I'll just let it you know Let the cuts and zooms do the work, but this one of course she's working real hard on it But it's like every time I film with the young book. It's just like it's a good time fun for the whole family for right now I'm gonna take a rest with my my body pillow for the longest time I would sleep like this, with like my pillow, like hugging my pillow. And people would say like that's a sign of like, someone being sensitive and like, they're protecting their heart, but bitch I don't fucking need anyone! I got Ryan, bitch! Just kidding. My eyes are so red. Yeah, my face is gonna be feeling for the next three days. So, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I probably, it probably would have been a smart idea to film videos first and then get the toy peel. But look at me being all fucking wild, I don't... Plan ahead, apparently. I've been like addicted to fried chicken from McDonald's. It is so fucking good. Say hi to Yaku. Hi! Hi. This bitch, Hola. as soon as he gets on camera, he's like a different. You've changed. <laughs> You've changed. Hola. He's visiting from uh. Where the hell do you live now? Tennessee. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm moving to San Francisco. Though, so. ah, oh, really? Yeah. Oh shit. So if y'all see me out there, don't say hi. <laughs> Um, if you're interested, I'll link his channel down below. You can find he does a bunch of K-pop related things, so I know y'all like that shit, so. I'm a Korean little. Mmm, I took a break from editing, because I just finished editing me and Eddie's, um, video. That took a long time. It was like an hour of footage, but I really, like, spent a lot of time editing, like, the little funny parts. Um, uh, but right now I'm gonna... The thing is, when you get, um, Troy Pill, you can't wash your face for, like... Uh, th until until the needles are gone, like the feeling, like this prickly feeling is gone. Um, but until then, I gave me one of these. 
They gave me one of these when I first got Troy Peel. But um, until then, I can only use the the mist. For, for tonight, I can use the mist. Then in the morning, I can use the mist again and then apply more of the healing cream. Love this beauty cream. Only problem is it's like $3 million. It's like, it's literally like nearly $100 for a fucking BB cream. But it's an actual, it's actually like, would you? Remember back when, oh my god. If you've watched my videos where I talk about this before, you're going to hear this again, I'm sorry. But for those of you that don't know, um, it, it, it goes back to the concept of what BB creams were meant to be, where um, they're supposed to be used for after skin, skin treatment, and it would help your, your uh, face heal, the healing cream. But it just has a little, it has pigment in it, so you know, it covers up the redness, and that's basically this one. Um, I'm so glad I got another bottle, though, because I, I rarely use this because I don't want Wasted. Joan over here is just like, I put it on every day. Literally like a, not even pea size, like a, a black head size and just, just gently like pat and blend. But yeah, my skin is going to be quite peely and dry for the next four and a half, maybe five days or so. So I know, I'd rather deal with this than like a laser though, because that was painful, it was ugly, and it was terrible looking. And honestly, you need, a, like, I for me, at my level of damaged skin, I would need several, several of those. For tonight, I'm going to use this as a mask, though, the HGT Hydro Essence, um, because that's all I'm allowed to do. I have this, like, brush from Hunt Free that I bought for when I put on, like, face masks and things, like peel-off packs and, um, wash-off packs. I was like, oh shit, this is so useful, like a brush just to put on like face masks, but then I realized I can just fucking put that shit on with my fingers. Like, I don't know why I gotta spend money on a fucking brush just to put, just to put on face masks, you know. Oh my gosh. Lay it on thick daddy, lay it on real thick. Me getting the skincare treatment and then having my face like all dry, peely, and kind of red. Reminds me of American Horror Story when she had like half her face burned off, but she had like sleepy ass eyebrows. She was like, you know what? I'm blind. I've lost my dignity, my confidence, and my ability to use my powers. But my brow's looking real good. That is me. All right, I'm gonna get back to editing and I will, oh shit, no. I'm gonna get back to editing and I'm going to play some more video games before I go to bed. And I need to edit this so I can put this up as well. <laughs> so I'll see you in my next video. Bye.